Hey, one day Sid Yai Bing, Cha Gan Welcome, everyone. I'm your host, Sid. I hope you're doing well, and I thank you for your continuing support to this channel. If you haven't already done so, please subscribe. Click on that red subscribe ball in the lower right. Also, share this video with others via email, Facebook, Twitter, or some other social media. The background today is Bing Gata. Bingata is a traditional stenciled dyeing technique that originated in Okinawa Prefecture. Bingata dates back to the 14th century during the Ryukyu Kingdom. It is believed that Bingata developed in Okinawa as a synthesis of Indian, Chinese, and Javanese dyeing techniques. Making Bingata kimono is very labor intensive, taking a month to make the cloth for a single kimono. During the Ryukyu Kingdom, the colors worn indicated the difference in classes at Chudi Castle. Only the royal family wore yellow, and nobility wore pale blue. Bingata was not typically worn by common people. Even the Bingata patterns were exclusive to each class. The patterns were usually birds, flowers, rivers, and clouds. Bingata is truly a beautiful traditional art unique to Okinawa. Today we will be discussing the sentence pattern, Unkai. Unkai indicates direction or place. It means to, at, or on. We will see several examples of the usage of the particle Unkai. I have used this particle in some examples in previous videos, but this will be the formal introduction to Unkai. Okay, let's start. Our first example is Unkai used to mean to. Let's go to Okinawa together. Uchinankai majung Ichabira. I will write a letter to my friend. Dushin kai tigami kachung. Let's go to Zippy's to eat. Zippy's kai kamui ga ika. We'll look at some examples where unkai is used to mean at. In this case, unkai will always indicate some location. There is a post office at Alamana Shopping Center. Alamana kai yu bing kyokunu ang. Today, Taru is walking at the park. Chu Taru ya koen kai achong. My mother is in the back of the house. Amma ya yanu kushin kai ui bing. Next, we'll look at some examples where unkai is used to mean on. I put my keys on the table. Kagi, table nu winkai uchang. The bird is on top of the house. Tue ya nu winkai ung. I have climbed on that mountain. Anu yamankai. Nubutaru kutu aibing. Our next exercise will be to review the vocabulary that we learned in our last video. You will provide the answer to the question, where is it? I will say the answer in English and you will provide the Uchinaguchi answer using the sentence particle unkai and appropriate vocabulary from the last video and aibing from video 13. I'll wait for you to reply and then give the answer. Where is it? The first answer in English is It is in the east. Agarinkai aibing. It is in the west. Irinkai aibing. It is in the north. Nishinkai aibing. It is in the south. Feinkai aibing. It is in the front. 
Meng Kai Ai Bing. It is in the back. Kushing Kai Ai Bing. It is in the front. Tang Kang Kai Ai Bing. It is to the right. Nijiring Kai Ai Bing. It is to the left. Hijain Kai Ai Bing. It is located up. Wing Kai Ai Bing. It is located down. Shichang Kai Ai Bing. It is inside. Nakang Kai Ai Bing. It is outside. Fukang Kai Ai Bing. It is located on the vertical. Tating Kai Ai Bing. It is located on the horizontal. Yukung Kai Ai Bing. It is located on the diagonal. Nambeng Kai Ai Bing. It is on the front or surface. Umuting Kai Ai Bing. It is on the reverse side or back. Urang Kai Ai Bing. It is on the side. Subang Kai Ai Bing. It is located on the bend. Magain Kai Ai Bing. It is on the corner. Kadung Kai Ai Bing. It is here. Kumang Kai Ai Bing. It is there. Amang Kai Ai Bing. It is close. Chikasang Kai Ai Bing. It is far. Tu sang kai ai bing. How did you do? We'll occasionally do these exercises to review because repetition is the key to understanding. If you found this video interesting, please share this video via email, Facebook, Twitter, or some other social media with your family and friends. Also, like if you enjoyed this video. This along with comments are the only way I know if the videos were appreciated. So this concludes this video. As always, thank you for viewing. Mata Yasai.